Hey, peasants. Now, what brings young lavish out here to do a video today? Well, I gotta address a couple of situations. Now, I wanna get this first one over with real quickly. As you guys know him, soldier boy, as I know him, broke boy, requested me to do this. As you could read that direct message, he said, go in that Louis store, buy a Louis backpack, and record yourself in the store buying it, and then rent a hotel room, and make a video inside the hotel room with it. Well, here is Lavish staying at the Fairmont Hotel, the top 10 most lavishest hotels in the city of San Francisco. Yup, that's Young Lavish for you. And we go, Louis Vuitton box right here. And there we go, got the, got the Louis dust bag right here. Let's open this guy up right now, and there we go, there comes out the beauty. Now remember, this is nothing for me, but a lot for you. There we go. As requested by the almighty peasant himself, broke boy. Now I gotta address the second thing. What a lot of people have been saying these days, that Louis Vuitton is average. Ooh. No, it's not. I gotta tell you guys this right now. I'm gonna be truthful when I say this. I mean, Louis Vuitton is not average. 50% of the Louis Vuitton I see out there is fake. Now, for, just like you peasants, when you see a Lamborghini rolling up the street, it sticks out to you. Well, Louis Vuitton, same thing to me. It sticks out to me because I live around this stuff. This stuff, I'm wearing it head to toe. Glasses, scarf, backpack, pants, all behind me too. Louis everywhere. I live around this stuff. I know what the real thing looks like. And the fake thing sticks out. It just sticks out to me. So I can tell you right now that 50% of the people I see in the city of San Francisco, Los Angeles, are all wearing fake Louis Vuitton. So that's covered right there. 50% of it's all counterfeit. And they act like it's real and you believe them because you've never owned the product they're wearing before. So you would just believe that it's real. When in reality it isn't. Now, the second thing out there is people actually do have the real Louis Vuitton. But, how, ask yourself this question. How many products do they even own? Do they own products as much as lavish? No. No. They don't. Do they, do they have multiple Louis Vuitton items like pants, glasses, and backpacks? Or do they only have one thing like a belt or a wallet? A small accessory, maybe just an iPhone case. Is that all? That doesn't make the brand average. It just shows that people are out there trying just so hard to be like Young Lavish. When in reality, that's not what's going on. You know, Louis Vuitton has its price point. Like $300 for a wallet, $650 for a belt, damn near $1,000 for a scarf. And the people out there that actually own one or two products of Louis Vuitton, they make it appear as if they bought it like that, when in reality, that wasn't the case. It was hard for them to buy that. It, they had to struggle real hard to buy that. I respect those who actually bought Louis Vuitton and are real about it and are like, hey, you know, I worked hard for this belt. It didn't come like that to me, but I don't respect those who are like, oh yeah, it's nothing to me. I bought it like that. I just dropped money on it real quickly. That's all. That I don't respect because I know deep down in your heart, you know that, be that belt you're wearing out there, that means a lot to you. And if you were to lose that the next day, you'd be done. You couldn't get a new one the next day. That's the truth. That's the that's the fact right there. And I'm just being real. I'm saying right now that Louis Vuitton, people that are out there, they don't have much. They only have a few things. And they make it appear as if they have a lot and it was easy for them to buy. And that's making, that's making that brand, Louis Vuitton, my favorite brand out there, looking bad. And I hate to see that. And that's why I need to bring out the truth right now for you guys. Louis Vuitton is still for rich people. And rich for me is just an understatement, but it is my favorite brand because the quality of this product, of all these products, really sticks out. The, the, the price is worth it. I mean, it's only $2,000, but then again, that is nothing for me, but a lot for you. So, you know, so that, that's what I wanted to say, you know, like Louis Vuitton, it is for rich people. You know, we celebrities, we wear that all the time. So you just got to do with the fact that I'm very rich, and it is lavish rich. Designer shades on my face. I am eating good on my plate. 
Like my presence. 